Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Custom Robo. Last time we entered Bogey's Battle Tournament and won our first match and got my favorite type of Robo in the game. The second match is about to start. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Doesn't anyone else fight this tournament? Good. Oh, you're next to Wall. Oh, God. Alright, let's continue. The next match is Mama Luigi versus Walt. I won my first match, too. Shatter won his match, too, of course. Don't want your guard down. Your next opponent is. Let's have a clean fight! Huh? Isn't that the guy who got to fight with his wife? Thank you for helping us! What are you doing in a seedy place like this? Well, it's like this. My wife owns all of our money. I, I don't get much left. So I figured this would be a good way to make some extra money. That's gotta be tough. You'd better believe it, Buster. Oh, wait. <laughs> By the way, a favor to ask. Can you take it easy on me? You know, so I can win. No can do. Sorry, but we got our reasons. Please, I'm begging you. My wife and four children are starving. We need this to live. Oh, what a pile of lies. You just said you wanted the money for yourself, you jerk. Oh, not again. Listen, you really need to get on with your battles, people. I beg of you, please! You won't help me! Nope. I think when you're gonna fire or use the pod, you can do any kind of pod, you can buy quick firing, and also use the corners of the house, see you your pod, got it. Okay, don't go easy on him. Okay, I won't. I'll kick his ass. So as you remember, he uses the funky big head model, and the left five way gun. This is a pain in the ass, but it shouldn't be that bad. Okay, so this is Wall Coliseum. It, or at least it always seems to be there when Walt's fighting, so I assume this is it. And it's actually a good choice for him because, uh, it, it's icy, and as a result, uh, as a result, you walk slowly and slide around. So yeah, it's actually pretty fitting policy. Because he should be sticking to the air, not because he's like an ice robo or anything. There's elements that don't play a part in this game. The only thing about the paint pods is that they don't blow up when you're playing the game, which is kind of fun. Actually, yeah, the paint pods are probably the worst choice to use against funky big head models, because they can just jump over them when they explode. I'm not using the self manager. Ah, the self function very well, am I? Ow, left five way gun. Or, dude, I'm losing. What the fuck is that? All right, time to uh stop fucking around. I hate that pod he uses. It's so fast and annoying. You might remember I'm using that uh, a strategy I mentioned earlier when fighting air uh, robos. You want to use the cover to your advantage. That's what I'm doing. And against uh, an air model like this, it's a good option. Ah, good option. Shit. Okay. <laughs> At least I got him. Four shots him off me. Up. If I was using the three-way gun, this would actually be a lot easier right now. As you can tell, the vertical gun doesn't aim as well as the three-way gun. Oh shit. It's 
See, I dodged the incoming gunfire because I'm so great. Oh, I guess I should turn this for you guys to charge. I can try it. Whoa, shit. Yeah, <laughs> that was pretty stupid. My bad. Game over. Damn it, poor. Yeah, I guess this guy is trying to get the opportunity to charge his different. Funky big head models are good like that. Damn, this might be my most action packed fight yet. There we go, finally got him. I think I'm gonna switch back to the three way gun. <laughs> I like that one better. Yeah! Javelin's a monster. I want a five way gun, but the thing's a piece of shit, so I don't want it. Oh, oh, I'll never afford that lovely toupee now! He wants a toupee? Alright. So that's what he was after. Uh, yeah, alright. I'm gonna switch up to the three way gun. I also think it works better for the Javelin because he can fly around the map and just giving constant waves of three way gun. It's difficult for an opponent to dodge. A five way gun, that sucks, deal. Semi finals, I'm gonna start. Are you ready? I am ready. I am ready. Ready. Oh, got him, got him. At long last, it's time for the semi finals. Next, Homer Luigi versus Harry. Doesn't really matter which of us gets to the finals, so let's make this for real. It'll be good practice. We don't get a lot of opportunities to really go at it, you know. It'll be exciting. Excuse me, I hate to interrupt, but could you start hurting each other now? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's start, my whole week. You're still a novice, so I'll give you just a bit more advice. How you jump the more vulnerable you become? Same goes for an air dash. You'll be vulnerable when you land after an air dash. So when you do a jump or an air dash from the wall, guy. Okay, then let's do that for real. You better not take it easy on me. All right, so we're gonna be fighting Harry, and this time he says it's for real. We already know what he does, so no need to go over it. And we already know where we're gonna be fighting in Harry's Coliseum. Yeah. Pretty simple. I'm actually not gonna hit the A button because uh it's gonna just come right out of the queue. Ah Haha, <laughs> I barely caused that actually. Oh I forgot I wanted to switch from faint pod. I think he's a guard. Okay, yeah, I can probably show you the charge here. See that? Look how much damage you can fucking do. I mean, the javelin's just a fucking tank. <laughs> Doing that combo is one of my favorite moves in this game. Because it works so well, you can get over 200 damage off. I mean, that's insane. Ow! Yeah, I'm a beast. That's how it's done. That was fun. Yeah, I have access to the caboose pod. I don't remember particularly liking that one. Man, I didn't think you'd be so good. I trained you well. Well, I know I told you not to hold back, but I didn't feel right going full strength on you. <laughs> Anyway, you're our man. Make sure you don't screw up. This is an important job. Alright, so we're gonna get to the final fight. I might as well get a caboose pod, even though I'm not gonna use it very much. Oh, I should switch from the uh, faint pods while I have the chance, because I don't really like them that much. Well, they're okay, but I don't work well with them. 
Uh, goose. Flies in the opposite direction of where you aim, which is retarded. Compl deploy two paws at once. Blows targets slowly upward. Use it to cover your escape while training. Yeah, pretty much. Nothing particularly special there. Okay, let's get to the next fight. Let's start the finals. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Excellent. Call your opponent. Here he is. This is Shiner. He's a dick. At last, we're at the finals. Has everyone placed their bets? Then let's begin. It's time for the finals. The ultimate showdown between China and our newest star, Nam and Luigi. Doesn't matter what you do, everyone will bet on me. I'm the best. A British accent does seem to fit him. Although, I'd rather do an Australian accent, but I'm not very... I know they're similar, but anyway. No one wants to throw away his money on an obvious loser. And you know what? I don't care all about whether these losers make this place a profit. As long as I'm making money, and these masters go weak in the knees, well, they see me, I'm happy. So tell me, are you jealous of my skill? Do you hate me? Eh? What do you say? Sorry, what was that? We were busy polishing our robo cubes. What is wrong with this guy? Excuse me. Yeah, yeah, we know. Don't want to keep him waiting, alright? Chew him up, Mama Luigi. That's a lie! I'm the one who's gonna eat him alive! I'll show you the power of breaking my Lightning Sky Rover! Lightning Sky? The Lightning Sky model is the newest addition to the custom robo line. It can attack and change directions while doing an air dash. So it basically glides and spurts air dash and it lasts a while. It can only air dash once, but it travels for a long time. It almost looks like it's flying, yeah, pretty much. However, it moves really slowly on the ground. It's got a low defense, and that's its weak. Got it? I don't know if I can win! It's, it's impossible! Alright, let's kick his ass. Fucking bitch. <laughs> Alright, so yes. He actually is using a pretty good combination. Let me, uh, let me show you real quick. He's using the Lightning Sky model, which we already know, which basically flies around the map. But he's actually using the Flamethrower. Um, the Flamethrower is actually very useful for the Lightning Sky model because it takes up a big location. So yeah, since his power increases over distance, yeah, it takes up a lot of the area where you're shooting. So it's very useful for Lightning Sky models. If that's the direction you want to go for the game, it'd be very useful. Anyway. So we're fighting here again. Nothing special about this whole scene. I'm probably gonna have to restart my freaking cube. Yeah. Shit. Oh, I made it. Alright, cool. But yeah, as you can tell, the Lightning Sky models have piss poor defense. And yeah, that's their weak. <laughs> Using my favorite strategy. See? Look how good the freaking jab one is, man. <laughs> oh shit! Ah! <laughs> what a dick. Oops. Boom! Yeah, that was easy. Shit, look how fast you feel. Pwned! That's his pwned stance. You now have access to the flame gun. Now saving. That's my cue to end the video. So, uh, see you folks next time. Bye!